Hello everyone, thank you for tuning into my channel. We're here with another plan with me from, what is this? The 25th through the 3rd. We're gonna date that. <laughs> this sticker kit is, if you watch my video from the website S-U-R-P-R-Z, this is the kit. I still had a ton of stickers left over. So I ended up doing, oh my God, where is it? Um, I ended up doing this page right here, like my March you know, for my months and all of that stuff. And by the time you see this video, I will already have a picture of this on my Instagram. So if you want to check it out, these stickers right here are from, um, oh my God, Christy Ann Designs. I should know that because we basically have the same name and these stickers as well. And this was um, Simply Gilded. So yeah, so I have my week planned out here. As you guys know, the way I do plan with me's is I put all the, you know, the I do all the hard work off camera <laughs> putting stickers in and the reason why I do that is because I like to take my time and decorate and I don't want to have to speed up the video I would rather you see it down see the planning see how I work around the stickers and then I don't mind putting like the little stickers on like this so that's basically why I do it but while we're sitting here um let me date this all right 28, 29. Oh my God, there's not 29 days in February. I was like, what the hell? Jesus, Kristen. It's okay. I don't mind crossing things out. I don't mind it. <laughs> so, um, plan with Lakin and Llama Letters, who is Cindy of PGW, did this video called like planner trends they don't understand and planner like pet peeves. I'm not gonna get into planner trends I don't understand because it's not for me to understand. That's what it is. But however you use your planner, whatever you do with your planner, that is for you and your system. I don't need to understand it, it's not for me. So I'm not gonna get into that. I do have some planner annoyances though. You know, let's. <laughs> Oh my God, Kristen, you're so vocal about your planner annoyances. Um, but you know, hey, we just we we gonna we gonna do it anyway. Um, I'm looking for um, where is it? I put some stickers in here. Um, yeah, these because I was I was tired of them like just sliding around. Um, I do have planner annoyances. Yes, I do. And I'm very vocal about my planner annoyances just because, just because I get paid on the 1st and the 15th. Um, so yeah, the reason why, um, well, okay, let's start, let's start all over. Trash day is right here. I'll put that right there. I have planner annoyances and for the most part, like for the most part, there aren't a lot of things that annoy me in the planning community. Cause I, you know, I kind of just keep to myself and I just, you know, mind my business and whatnot. And, you know, and I think that's the best way to be in any aspect, in any area of whatever you're doing. Um, what is this? Oh, we're gonna do laundry. And so that's not, but there are some things that kind of annoy me in, I simply just ignore it for the most part and you know, I know whatever um one of the things that annoys me is people who don't write in their planners you guys should know this you guys should know this because I talk about it. I don't understand people who don't write in their planners I don't get it I've seen people who say they buy stickers and they're scared to use them and that's it that's it that's a thing that annoys me when people don't use their stickers um I mean use your stickers that's what they're there for that is what they are there for, to use them. So yeah, that's one thing that annoys me when people don't use their stickers. Um, and people that don't use their monthly spreads. <sighs> Yo, no, it's not that people don't use them. It's when people say they, like they, they ask like, what do you use your monthly spread for? And I look at them like they have two heads because I'm not even understanding. What do you mean? What do you mean what do I use it for? They're like, isn't it obvious? Um, but yeah, they say they don't know what to use it for. And my thing is this, is that I cannot function during the week if my month is not bigger, is not filled out. And the reason I say that is because 
I have kids that have doctor's appointments. Um, I usually am the one that makes my husband's appointments because he's at work. And so he'll be like, oh, make an appointment for this. Or can you verify this? And sometimes those appointments are three weeks out. Sometimes they're four weeks out, two weeks out, whatever. And so I need to be able to put that on my monthly spread. And so whenever I'm planning, I look at my month, whatever week is coming up, and I plan my week. And so my monthly needs to be filled out before um, before I start that week. And that's what you can use them monthly for. Also, I mean, paying bills, that type of thing. Paying bills, um, payday, you know, all your bills, your utilities, you know, what day does your trash need to be set out? You know, what day you have recyclable, what day do you recycle? And, you know, what days, do you, you know, go to the gym? You know, that type of thing. I don't know. I don't know. Um, but like that type of thing. Like, what do you, like, what are y'all doing with your life? <laughs> like, really, like, what are we doing? Um, and so, I, like, I don't get it. I, I don't understand it. I don't get it. People who don't use our monthly pages. But, um, but yeah, that's, that's, that's pretty much it. That really annoys me. Um, you know, I don't. Oh, oh, I know one thing that annoys me, and anybody who uses Happy Planner can attest to this, okay? You know what annoys me is when people go to the store and hoard all of the fucking stickers, okay? That's what I don't like. I don't like that shit. Um, my friend Jamie was telling me that she went to um, a Hobby Lobby in Joanne because she was looking to get me some stickers, and... A lady was there who was also looking for stickers. She's like, oh, are you looking for stickers? And Jamie was like, yeah. And she tells me that she, the lady was at a Hobby Lobby or something. And one of the customers there had just like a basket full of supplies. And the lady thought she worked at Hobby Lobby. She didn't. She said she was buying all that stuff and she was listing it on eBay. You, you, you see, look, I don't like that. It's not fair. I'm not, look, if you, if you're going to buy these stickers and use them, by all means, but I don't think you need 17 of the same sticker book. And it's not fair that you're going to put these on eBay and jack up the prices just to do it. It's not fair for people who actually want to buy the stickers. And so, you know, my friend Jamie, she went to, where did she go? She said she ended up going to Joanne. They didn't, ha they didn't even have it out yet. Um, and I was just like, this is ridiculous. Like, who does this? And that's, that's what I don't like. I don't like, like no other planner company customers or whoever resellers do this to any other planner company. It's only Happy Planner that does this and I don't get it. I don't understand why y'all need to get all these stickers and resell them for ridiculous ass prices. I just, it's, it's annoying. It's annoying to say the least. It's really annoying. I just, I wish y'all would stop that. Like I really wish you guys would stop. Um, like my Joanne here doesn't really sell. Um, happy planner stuff. They just don't. And my hobby log is too far. It's too far for me to, to maybe call in and check in every single week. I just, I can't do it. So I just kind of like at this point, this juncture, I'm just kind of like, I don't even care. Um, like I would love some of the new books, but I'm not going out of my way to get any of the new books. I'm just not going to do it. Um, because it's just pointless. It's just pointless. I'm, I'm not going to fight with somebody over some stickers. And when you gotta go crazy over stickers, you gotta kind of you have to step back and say, Kristen, it's stickers, it's paper. You got a drawer full of Mavi stickers. Use them shits first. You know. <laughs> you know. So yeah, let's get the writing. But that's pretty much it. I don't like when people hoard all the stickers, and I don't I don't like people who don't use their planners. That that annoys me. If you don't use your planner, you hoard all the stickers. That's it. That's it. That's all. So yeah, we're gonna write down the same stuff I write down every week. I know. Um, but you know, if it doesn't, I mean, if it doesn't get written, it doesn't get done. And I always say it's like, it's not that I forget. It's easy for me to forget to take my medication. It's very easy because I get the biz, get busy doing whatever it is I'm doing. And, I, and then it gets here, it's like three o'clock. And my medication has caffeine in it. And I'm just like, fuck, you know? Um, and so, Oh, the blue can is coming. Is it? 
I don't think it is. Hmm. Maybe it is. I don't know. I'll put a sticker. Just I don't want to waste a sticker if it's not. I'll just. <laughs> All right. I'll just put. Put a question mark. Um, but you know, if it there's been days where I, I forget to take my medication, and so and I remember like my face routine. As soon as I see, I'm like, oh, let me go do my face, and even, I'm pretty diligent about it. Um, but it's just for me to know to take note to it or whatever. You know, you guys know what I'm talking about. So yeah. Um, so yeah. Oh, I, I think something got delivered to my door. I think something did. Okay, so we're gonna go to Tuesday. Um, all right. All right, and filming. Oh, I don't need to write that. I just need to put it right here. My March plan with me will be up on Thursday. So that is what I'm doing. And Wednesday again, we have half week. Oh, we have early outs. That's what we have. Okay, let's get my Sarah Elizabeth Prince stickers. It's always, oh, there we go. I'm like, it's always the last one. Um, sometimes I forget. I'm like, why is my daughter rolling up here an hour early? <laughs> All right, so that just lets me know that there's an early out. Because, you know, sometimes as mothers, you guys can relate, we just lose track of days. We'll know when Friday gets here. Oh, yes, we'll know that. But we're just like, what's today? <laughs> It'll be like Wednesday. You're like, I don't know what today is. I just know that I had to get up early. So I know it's a weekday. But, um, but yeah, okay. So Wednesday. And we got half week. And we're back to all room. Self-care. I'm telling you guys, I've been on it when it comes to my self-care. I have let nothing get in between it at all. Absolutely nothing. All right. And so that is that for that week right there. For that half of the week. And so we're moving on to the 28th, which is Thursday. More self-care men's. Okay, and just because I only put like all rooms on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday doesn't mean I don't clean on Tuesday and Thursday. It just, it's spot cleaning everyday things. So it's like mopping the kitchen floor and spot, you know, the countertops and whatnot. So I pretty much know what I need to do. Actually, I'm gonna write it down. If it, look, if it doesn't get written, it doesn't get done. So for Tuesday, I'm gonna put, so you guys can actually know what I do. So I'm gonna put um, countertops, um, and that's for the kitchen and the bathroom and what else? Uh, vacuum girls. Oh, mop kitchen. There we go. And so I'll write that right there. What do I have for Thursday? Self-care match. Uh, set out. Crash, countertops, vacuum, and mop, mop kitchen. Okay, so we have all rooms, self-care, men's journal all right saturday we have okay so so skincare now saturday i don't really have anything going on I like, i'm gonna leave the weekend blank just because i don't know what's going on for the weekend not yet so yeah that is pretty much my plan with me for this week. 
I did a little bit of rambling, but we're good. <laughs> so yeah, that is how this week is looking. Are we focused? All right, and I still have a ton of space like always. I like to leave a lot of white space. I, I have to have white space, got to. So yeah, that is it. And I do hope you guys enjoyed this and enjoyed my rambling a little bit. And if you have any questions or comments, leave them down below. And I will have my coupon code for 10% off for this down below. So if you're not subscribed, go ahead and do that. Hit the notification bell. And I will see you all next time. Bye.